people with the spirit of name welcome back into my youtube channel this is Angga Rizky and why a long time no see so I've been busy for working into many projects so right now I'm moving on to the iOS with the new version of the Swift language which is the 5.0 okay so right now I'm going to show you how do we make the splash screen with the uh, sketch and then Xcode so first of all we have to uh, create a new Xcode project Okay, and then I just select the single view app. I put the name maybe a sketch sketch. Yeah, just for the example. Uh, so okay, so I'm going to save it into my desktop. You can choose uh, anywhere you want, but right now just for the demo only. Okay, so this is the uh, Xcode, the new version. So I already log in with the, my personal team which is Angariski but you have to uh, login first and this is the display name sky step sorry sky Scat app okay all right so if you see in the left side there is the sorry they are the main storyboard and then the launch screen right so basically the main storyboard is your primary screen after the application has been opened with the someone else but uh, there is the launch screen so this is the place when uh, where you want to put the whole design that relate into the splash screen so first of all we have to go to uh, assets I'm going to create a new image assets that I called it app logo okay and then in the sketch that I have uh, one logo, this is I got it for free. So I'm going to export it and select the option into the iOS. So they will generate a three version, a different version of the high resolution and then the low resolution. Okay, so we're gonna export them and I'm going to add logo sky sketch. Okay, and then just export. So if you see in my desktop, I uh, I, I do have the uh, app logo with the three version I just easily to drag and drop into the Xcode and they will put it as a universal okay but you could also change it to the iPhone okay so this is actually that we have to move it into the iPhone so we put again but it will be identified by the universal so it doesn't matter okay this okay so we're going to the launch screen here and this is the place where we set up the design for the splash screen i just simply to go to a view and then oh sorry i need the library so just a sole library we need the image view okay just simply drag and drop so before we setting up the images, we have to back into the sketch, and I'll see that there's the uh, sizes, width, and height. So we have to uh, setting up based on the design that I did, one eight four by uh, eight three. Okay. Once you set up, just make it to the center, and remove this. We don't need this because we want to keep it on the center, as you can see in the preview. So after that, we have to load the app logo just like this. Very simple, right? And we go back into the sketch. I'm going to copy this uh, hex code because we need them to change our background. So if we want to change the background, just select this a view. And we have to setting up to the custom color. Once uh, you choose the custom color, it will open the window. The new window and then you select the rgb sliders here okay okay boom very nice right so right now uh if we play it into the iphone x or maybe iphone x i already opened the iphone uh, x simulator so i don't have to open anymore so i just want to run and waiting for at the moment so let's try to take uh, a run again okay you see that wow it's pretty nice right it's working properly right 
so if you setting up this uh, design into the launch screen it's gonna be the splash screen but if you provide the design in the main storyboard okay by example I'm changing this background into the uh, black one like this the one that we set up previously so whenever you run this application it's gonna open the launch screen first before they're heading into the main storyboard okay so in the main storyboard that we have a sample text just up for the text label so we call it a label here so just put a label and I just want to put just drag and drop and ready for sketch okay so the color is a uh, white color and we need the custom font which is Helvetica so if you see in the design the font type is Helvetica with the 24 font sizes so here we just need to simply just put 24 okay and we put in the middle and setting up the responsiveness yeah just like that okay and then we try again to run again and let's see how it's gonna look like wow really nice right so this is the very simple way how do we setting up the splash screen for the design in the ios and then sketch with the xcode okay so thank you very much do not forget to subscribe and i'll see you in the next video so goodbye